much. Yeah, a lot of skiers and snowboarders in our state will be having their turkey after a day on the slopes mm -hmm. this year. Multiple ski resorts in our state are set to open Thursday. One resort is doing more than just making snow. It's also debuting some new technology. Spencer Schott spoke with the folks at Ski Santa Fe. And Spencer, it sounds like the goal here is just to get people on the mountain faster. Yeah, that's exactly right, Tessa. This, new, this year, Ski Santa Fe will be using high-tech RFID passes. And if you have one, you can bypass the line at the ticket office and and hopefully the lines at the lifts move a little quicker. Every lift at Ski Santa Fe has something new in front of it. Gates that use radio frequency ID technology, or RFID for short. No longer need to wait for a lift up to manually come and scan your pass. Um, you put your pass in your left hand pocket, um, approach the gantries, um, the new gates will read the chip in your pocket via radio frequency and the gates will automatically open for you. The goal of these gates is to keep the lines moving with less hassle and these cards are reloadable. So when you come back, you can skip the line at the ticket office too. I think it's really a focus on making things as easy as possible for our guests, um, getting our guests up on mountain and enjoying the slopes as quickly and as efficiently as possible. While these gates are the main change skiers and snowboarders will see this year, even more changes are on their way. The high speed detachable lifts are, um, that's kind of what everyone's building these days. So modern lifts, um, they are easier to load and unload. Uh, and then they have a uh, faster transport time. This high speed lift will be replacing the main quad at Ski Santa Fe and will cut the ride time to the top of the mountain in half, but it's not ready to go this season. So we're going to start as soon as we close the ski area next winter. So uh, sometime in April and uh, we'll start by removing uh, chair one and, and we'll be getting after it from there. Hopefully completion sometime in October of 2024. Even without a new lift this year, the new RFID passes are sure to speed things up. I'm actually feeling pretty good. Uh, I know our staff has been hard at work making sure everything is in place. Um, staff has been testing. We've had people up here kind of all week um, running through things. Ski Santa Fe's first day will be this Thursday, Thanksgiving, and they say they are hard at work making snow, so they'll have a few runs open and ready to go for those ready to hit the slopes. Well, and I'm a, a proud one-pass holder, so I'm excited. Spencer, thank you.